Today we are going to review two Bibles from Holman. Thank you for sending these to me, Holman. We are going to review the Giant Print Reference Bible and the Large Print Compact Reference Bible. Let me tell you just the big differences between these two because these two Bibles are nearly identical other than the obvious size difference. The giant print reference Bible that I received from Holman, this is a genuine leather edition, and this comes in two types, the indexed and then the non-indexed. The indexed is $65.99 and the non-indexed is $58.99. The large print compact comes in a variety of colors, but it doesn't come in genuine leather. It only comes in imitation leather. This costs $14.99. So the size of the giant print reference is a little over 10 inches by 7 inches or a little bit over 7 uh, inches and about 1.7 inches thick. And then the large print compact reference is about 6.5 inches by 4.5 inches and it's about 1.5 inches thick. So it's a little bit similar in size to the personal size Quintel from Skylar. Another obvious difference between the two Bibles is the font size. The giant print is 13 point and then the large print compact is 8 point. Both of these Bibles have a durable smite sewn lay flat binding. They both have gilded page edges. One major con of this Bible is the ribbon markers, or the number of ribbon markers. They only have one in each of these Bibles. When we open the Bible, you can see that they're both uh, not edge-lined. They are both paste down liners. Both Bibles are double column format. Both Bibles have cross-references, but not down the center. It's over to the side of the page. Both Bibles have topical subheadings. Both Bibles have words of Christ in red, and I'll talk a little bit more about that later. And then at the end, or at the back of the Bible, they have topical index and then full color maps. Let me tell you a major pro for both of these Bibles before we go into the cons. The layout is really beautiful. It's clean, I think it's well designed, and it's very readable or easy on the eyes to read. The large print compact is really a nice EDC, a nice everyday carry Bible. You can just chuck this in your bag or in your purse or whatever bag you use. The giant print reference is not so portable. I wouldn't say it's a uh, everyday carry portable size, but it is a nice portable Bible. Here is the major con of both of these Bibles. The paper. It's thin. There's a lot of show through. The paper is not great. Again, the paper is good enough. I mean, for a uh, for the price range of these Bibles, it's what you would expect. But for me, it was a little too thin. Another major con, actually, I wouldn't even say a major con. A con is the red letter. It's not consistent. It looks more brownish umber than it does red. But as it is, you can see there's a lot of variation in the red lettering. It looks brown, more brown than red. And in some cases, it looks kind of pink. Okay, giveaway time. If you would like to win this Bible, this is the Genuine Leather Giant Print Reference, here are the rules. Again, thank you to Holman for sending me these two Bibles for an honest review. I think these are very good editions for the price. A Giant Print Reference Edition for those of you who need something larger print, and then for those of you who want a smaller compact size, the Large Print Compact. That's it, everybody. Have a great day.